Hey, this is Ben from 20 millimeters and today I will show you how I started building some things here out of this Italieri Stalingrad box, starting with the 40 millimeter puck. Gun and infantry in the sprue look very good, so the first step is cutting them out. I am using this Falla clippers for it and the file. I can recommend the Falla, I'm using it for years and still sharp. Some parts of the gun snap fit very well as you see here. Others like the wheels you have to rework and drill a hole in to get them adjusted. Fix the cannon shield before you fix this small part to the barrel because otherwise you cannot fit the shield over it. So that's what you get when you do it first shield first and after that apply this part. Still have to drill the holes here for the wheels. After the Puck 40 I started with Panzer 4 which is also a snap fit kit here. Cut all the pieces out of the frame Use the file to flatten the edges, glue the lower part with the upper part and then you need to watch out, put the bolt into the top plate and not into the turret. Otherwise it won't fit and you don't want to glue both parts before base coating them, otherwise you won't reach some of the places. You have two options for the main gun. I think this will be a project for using magnets so that I will be able to change between both of them. Up next I worked on the T-34s. There are two inside of this kit, also very nice and easy snap fit models. And same as with the T-34, make sure to put the bolt onto the top plate of the tank and not into the turret. And you can think about two options how to handle the tracks. On one I decided to already glue them, on the other one I will keep them separate and see which version makes me happier while painting. That was the work for today. Up next I will try to glue the Sarissa Precision Tank Factory and then I will start painting. I got the advice for the MDF laser card things that you paint them first, at least a base coat and then glue them. So I'll show it to you in part two. Uh, if you liked it, give a thumbs up and leave a subscription. See you soon.